what's going on everybody? Ronnie DiMaggio here, product specialist at BMW of Morristown. And in today's video, we have a very special M3 to share with you guys today. This is an M3 M50 Yare limited edition model. So the M3 M50 Yare limited edition model, quite a mouthful of a name, but it is to commemorate 50 years, BMW M's 50th anniversary. So BMW M, as we know today, was founded in 1972. And so BMW came out with this model to commemorate the 50th anniversary of its M sub-brand. And what a 50 years it's been, and this is the car to commemorate that. And this is a one of 500 limited edition model that has some unique touches, some unique options, and things like that to differentiate it from a standard standard M3. Um, so we're going to talk about all those little things that are specific to the M50 Yari edition. We're not going to get super in depth with the interior and the performance stuff because we've done that in a bunch of other M3 videos. Uh, I'll link to those here in an info card for you in the top right of your play uh, screen. But we did the M3 with a stick shift, the base M3, just last week. We did the M iDrive 8 with a xDrive Comp M3 a couple weeks ago, and then we also did a 2022 m3 so we have plenty of m3 content if you're interested in that please go check it out but for this one we're just going to focus on the limited stuff so first thing you're probably noticing is this paint color those of you with a really keen eye might be able to recognize it it is interlagos blue metallic that is one of five unique paint color options available for the m50 yari edition so the m uh this edition limited edition m3 is available in five colors that all are designed to commemorate a previous generation of m3 so you have cinnabar red to commemorate the e30 you have techno violet metallic which is super cool to commemorate the e36 you have interlagos blue here to commemorate the e46 you have fire orange to commemorate the e92 m3 the lime rock park edition e92 gts um, that that came out uh, that color came out with, and then you have uh, Lime Rock Gray to commemorate the F80 M3 CS. So those five colors were all iconic from a previous generation of M3, and they're all options on this car. Speaking of options, uh, if we want to come around to the side of the car, we can start talking about that. The only things that were optional on this car were the paint color, the brake caliper color, whether or not you wanted carbon ceramics, and whether or not you wanted carbon bucket seats. Uh, that was pretty much it. So these all come in a fully loaded spec. So they all have executive package, parking assistance, so on and so forth. They all have carbon fiber interior trim um, and whatnot. But those are your options. So they all come pretty well uh, equipped. But before we get around to the side, one thing we want to point out on the front that is unique to the M50 RA is this carbon fiber front splitter. So that is an M performance part that comes on all 50 RA M3s. Looks really cool. Adds a little bit of extra kind of dimension and just a little flare to the front end. We see a bunch of G80s uh, and M4s, G82s with carbon fiber front splitter. So BMW um, at, in the aftermarket, it's a common thing is what I mean. And BMW gave it to us OEM for the M50R edition, which is super cool. You can also see the laser lights. All of these limited edition models get laser lights as well. Like I said, they all come super well equipped, which is awesome. Um, also in that area, we can take a look at these wheels, which are also unique to the M50 RE edition. These are the 826 M's, which you can get in either bicolor or black on a standard non-limited M3. However, uh, these ones are finished in orbit gray, which you cannot get in the 826 M's with uh, a non-M50 RE M3. So you get a unique wheel model and finish combination for the limited edition, which looks great. Uh, I think the 826s look awesome in black and bicolor. They look stunning in orbit gray. I think it's one of the best OEM wheels and finishes that BMW's done in a long time, and they make a lot of good OEM wheels, so that's saying something. I think those wheels look awesome. Uh, you can also see the paint uh, on the brake calipers on this car is blue. It matches the inner Lagos really well. It actually matches up quite nicely. Um, but that is one of the things you can customize. You can do blue, red, or black on the brake calipers. Um, or if you get carbon ceramics, the calipers are gold no matter what. So that's one of the few things you can customize. Uh, if we want to come around to the side of the car, as the sun is kind of behind us now, you can see it on the car. You can see the inner Lagos blue has a really beautiful metallic effect to it. Uh, it's a really, really pretty paint color, a very kind of pure blue. It reminds me a little bit of velvet blue 
just a little bluer and less purple with a lot of metallic in it. Uh, overall, just a really gorgeous color. Um, but as far as unique things to the M50RA, nothing special on the side, really nothing unique beside the wheels. All cars come with a carbon fiber roof, cannot get a moonroof on the limited edition. Uh, but if we want to come around to the back, this is where they did some of my favorite things for the M50RA. One being this carbon fiber spoiler, which looks awesome. It is real carbon fiber, of course, and it looks great. Has a little bit um, of a nice flare to it with the kind of cut down in the middle. Just a good looking spoiler, very BMW. So that is part of the M50R edition, uh, as are the exhaust tips, which are probably my favorite thing. So you get some unique titanium and carbon fiber exhaust tips, and they have those cutouts inside of them, like almost like baffles on the inside of the exhaust tips, which look really cool. Hopefully you guys can see that on camera. Uh, so the exhaust tips are unique and are certainly one of my favorite things for the M50RA. So to summarize the differences on the exterior, you get the front lip, the unique wheels, um, you get the unique paint colors that are only available. You cannot get any of those five paint colors on a G80 that's not an M50RA. Uh, you get the spoiler and you also get those super cool exhaust tips. There are also some accessories that come with the car, so we will show you those in just a second and some changes on the interior. So let's move on to those things now. All right, so around back of the M3 M50 Yari edition, uh, we are going to pop the trunk, but not to talk about practicality, uh, but because there's something pretty cool in the trunk. This is the BMW M lightweight suitcase that comes with the M. 50R edition. It is made of a lightweight polycarbonate material, which is awesome that BMW even went so far as to make the suitcase out of a lightweight material. How M is that? Super cool. Uh, and as you can see, when we spin it around, it comes with those cool BMW and M decals on the side and a locking mechanism, which is super cool. So it is a very high quality feeling suitcase and it feels very sturdy but it's also lightweight, so you can race through the airport in true M fashion with your lightweight suitcase. Uh, we say that kind of, you know, tongue in cheek, it's a little funny, but it's also really cool that BMW went through the effort uh, to make this special edition and then make a special suitcase specific to the cars and to be delivered with the cars, which is super cool. So these suitcases come with all M50R editions, which is awesome. and. That is one of the unique things about the M3 M50 RA, but um, practicality is just like a normal M3. The rear seat space and the trunk space is all the same. Interior dimensions are unchanged for the limited model. Um, but that's the suitcase. Let's go ahead and hop inside where there are some more unique changes to the M50 RA. All right, so inside of the M50 RA edition M3, we do have a couple of unique touches which are super cool to differentiate the M limited edition first one is on the door sill there so as soon as you step in the car you're reminded that you're not just getting into any other m3 you have that cool plaque to commemorate the limited edition and the 50th anniversary of bmw m you also get uh, some unique stitching on the seats so you can see that the seat bottom has red stitching and then the seat back actually has blue stitching so red and blue obviously important colors for bmw m and by the way, all M3 limited models, the M50 RAs come with a black extended merino leather interior. Cannot get the full merino leather interior, just the black extended. Uh, we also have some unique M stripes on the seats. So those are unique to the limited model. And those are kind of a callback to the E36, if I remember correctly. Those were super common on the E36, so really fun to see that brought back. You also get those stripes on the seat headrests for the back seats, which is fun. So the back seat passengers don't miss out on the M specialness, which is super cool. Um, carbon buckets, by the way, like we said, are an option. This one obviously has the standard seats, but you can get carbon buckets if you would like. Other unique things for the limited edition model uh, include this little plaque in the middle, which is super cool. It says M350 Yare BMW M, one of 500 with the M stripes there uh, with our M colors, light blue, dark blue or purple and red. So super cool to see that little plaque. Uh, but that does do it for the interior changes that are special for the limited model. Otherwise, the interior is pretty standard M3. You have carbon fiber trim as standard with the carbon paddles. Uh, that is not optional. You can't change that. If you get a 50RA, you're getting the carbon trim. Same thing with the black leather and things of that, nat that nature. You have heads-up display, parking assistance package, 
um, all those kind of highly optioned things and you only get carbon fiber roof, uh, no moon roof. Um, so that is the interior of the 50 Yara M3. If you want more details on the M3 interior in general, we have a couple of videos for you to check out. We'll uh, put those in the little info card section in the top right. Uh, so check those out if you want more details on the M3 in general. But that's it for the 50 RA interior. Let's hop outside and wrap up. All right, so that is going to do it for our walk around and overview with the M3 M50 Yare edition. So cool to be able to check one of these out in person. It is a cool and special car for BMW M to celebrate their anniversary. M has had a story history and it's always nice when they commemorate that with uh, all the M50 year stuff that they did this year and the limited edition model. So really happy we got to share this car with you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop a like on the video and consider subscribing to the channel if you think we deserved it. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok at BMW of Morristown, or come visit us at 111 Ridgedale Ave here in Morristown, New Jersey. But that's going to do it for this one. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.